Did you know that Albert Einstein's brain was actually stolen? When Einstein died in 1955 at the age of 76, his family wanted a simple cremation. But during the autopsy, something shocking happened. The pathologist, Dr. Thomas Harvey, secretly removed Einstein's brain without asking for permission. Why would he do this? Harvey believed that by studying the brain, he might discover the source of Einstein's legendary genius. Instead of returning it, he kept it hidden. He even sliced it into more than 200 pieces, preserved them in jars, and sent samples to researchers around the world. For decades, Einstein's family had no idea. When they eventually found out, they were furious. Some even called it a betrayal. But by then, the brain had already become a strange scientific treasure. And here's the mystery. Studies on Einstein's brain showed unusual features, like extra folds in areas linked to math and spatial reasoning. But scientists still can't agree if that really explains his genius or if the whole thing was just an invasion of privacy. Even today, fragments of Einstein's brain are still kept in museums and laboratories. So what do you think? Was stealing Einstein's brain a groundbreaking step for science or one of the greatest violations of a genius in history?